India is making substantial investments to enhance its naval capabilities, particularly focusing on its submarine fleet. The goal is to establish a robust underwater presence to secure its maritime interests and enhance deterrence capabilities. The primary projects include Project 75I, Project 75 Alpha, and Project 76, each addressing different aspects of submarine warfare and technology. Project 75I, Advanced Conventional Submarines. Scope and Objectives, Project 75I is a $6.14 billion initiative to construct six advanced conventional submarines equipped with air-independent propulsion, AIP, systems. The AIP technology allows submarines to remain submerged longer than traditional diesel-electric submarines, enhancing stealth and operational range. Indigenous Production a significant aspect of Project 75I is its emphasis on indigenization. Two Indian shipyards, Massagon Dock Shipbuilders Limited, MDL, and Larson and Tubro, LNT, will collaborate with foreign companies from Russia, France, Spain, Germany, and South Korea. This partnership aims to transfer technology and build the submarines domestically. Technological Features the AIP system is a key feature, enabling extended underwater endurance. Additionally, the project encourages the integration of state-of-the-art sensors, weapons, and stealth technologies. These enhancements are expected to significantly improve the Indian Navy's anti-submarine warfare capabilities. Timeline The formal tender process for Project 75 I started in 2021, with the first submarine expected to be operational by 2030. This timeline reflects the project's complexity and the strategic importance of integrating advanced technologies and domestic manufacturing capabilities. Project 75 Alpha Nuclear-Powered Attack Submarines SSNs. Scope and Objectives Project 75 Alpha focuses on developing six nuclear-powered attack submarines SSNs. These submarines are crucial for extended patrols and maintaining a persistent underwater presence, essential for strategic deterrence. Technological advancements. The SSNs will feature pump jet propulsion, which offers better stealth and speed compared to conventional propellers. Pump jet systems reduce noise, making the submarines harder to detect. This technological edge is vital for covert operations and enhances survivability in hostile environments. Strategic importance. Nuclear-powered submarines can remain submerged for prolonged periods, providing a continuous and credible deterrent. This capability is crucial for India's second strike capability, ensuring a robust response in case of a nuclear attack. Timeline. The development of SSNs under Project 75 Alpha is a long-term endeavor, with the first units expected to be operational by the early 2030s. This timeline allows for the integration of advanced nuclear technologies and the establishment of the necessary infrastructure. Project 76 – Indigenous Conventional Submarines Scope and Objectives Project 76 aims to build 12 indigenous conventional submarines with advanced propulsion and combat systems. This project underscores India's commitment to self-reliance in defense production. Technological innovations. These submarines are expected to feature the latest in propulsion technology, potentially integrating advancements like lithium-ion batteries, which offer better performance and reliability than traditional battery systems. The use of modern combat systems and sensors will enhance the submarine's operational capabilities. Indigenization efforts. A crucial component of Project 76 is the focus on indigenization. The collaboration between MDL and the Indian Navy's Warship Design Bureau aims to develop over 8,000 components domestically. This effort aligns with the broader, Make in India initiative, reducing dependency on foreign technology and fostering local expertise. Timeline. Project 76 is expected to progress through the late 2020s and into the early 2030s, with the first submarines entering service around this time frame. The extended timeline reflects the project's ambition to incorporate cutting-edge technologies and achieve high levels of indigenization. Complementary Initiatives. 
Next Generation Midget Submarines In addition to these large-scale projects, India is also developing midget submarines for specialized operations such as special forces deployment, oceanography, and tourism. These submarines are designed to be versatile and are expected to be launched by the end of 2024. Surface Combatants and Broader Naval Modernization India's broader naval modernization includes the Next Generation Corvette NGC, program, Project 17A B for Frigates, and the Next Generation Destroyer NGD, program. These initiatives complement the submarine projects, ensuring a well-rounded and capable naval force by 2030. Strategic Implications Enhanced Deterrence the development of advanced submarines significantly enhances India's deterrence capabilities. Nuclear-powered submarines ensure a credible second strike capability, while advanced conventional submarines enhance maritime security and anti-submarine warfare capabilities. Technological Leadership By integrating cutting-edge technologies like AIP, lithium-ion batteries, and pump-jet propulsion, India aims to position itself as a technological leader in naval warfare. These advancements also contribute to the broader defense manufacturing ecosystem, fostering innovation and self-reliance. Regional Power Projection A robust and modern submarine fleet allows India to project power in the Indian Ocean and beyond, securing its maritime interests against regional threats. This capability is crucial given the strategic competition in the Indo-Pacific region. Conclusion India's submarine projects, including Project 75I, Project 75 Alpha, and Project 76, reflect a comprehensive strategy to enhance its underwater warfare capabilities by 2030. These initiatives focus on advanced technologies, indigenization, and strategic partnerships, positioning India as a formidable maritime power. The successful implementation of these projects will significantly bolster India's naval capabilities, ensuring maritime security and strategic deterrence in the coming decades.